Hello and welcome to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe if you liked this video. And thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you to my day ones, twos, and threes. Thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in. That means well. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you all and welcome, welcome, welcome. This video is for entertainment and educational purposes only. So everything is alleged, some is not. And the fair act use is in my description box, y'all. So let's get to it. Let's get to it. Okay, y'all. First, I want to say happy Thursday. I hope everybody is having a wonderful day. Please stay safe and all that good stuff. Please stay aware of your surroundings. And please, y'all, watch the company that you keep because it just may save your life or keep you out of trouble. Okay, y'all. So, let's get to it, y'all. Y'all, we've been having some haters in the comment section. I've been blocking all, every time I jump on, I've been blocking, 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 okay? Um, we got, they got some serious minions that they sending over here to troll. <laughs> and, and they so stupid. You know, you got to go and keep doing another account, another account after I block you. You can't say nothing else. So, you know, why waste your time? Just go to somebody else's page that you want to listen to instead of troll somebody else's page. I'm just saying, y'all. I don't get it, but I, they doing their job, y'all. They doing their job. Well, let's get to it, y'all. Let's get to it. So, um, there's some changes of brewing, y'all, in Dolph's case all of a sudden, y'all. And people are cooperating more and um, a little doors is opening up for them. A little something, something, something. Okay, y'all? And I'm going to say this. The same people that have been snitching now, they don't have a choice but to snitch because the more information is coming out that's tied in with the information that allegedly, allegedly, allegedly is coming from Puffy, y'all. Y'all, it's about to go down, y'all. Puffy is about, you know how they was talking about they was going fishing and all of this stuff and then a, a, a big artist get taken out and this and that and that and this. Well, they are the bait now, y'all. <laughs> they are the bait now. And they're getting bigger fishes off of the fishes that they're catching right now. They got so much dirt piled up on Puffy. He has no choice but to tell. Okay, stuff that Stray Drop was telling in the jail, um, he has no choice now but to tell. You were in the clothing line twice. Not in the clothing line, but you was in the clothing line, allegedly, at that window. And then you were also promoting this clothing line in your video while you were on the run. So you got to now talk about where that idea came from. Okay, y'all? See, a lot of stuff is popping out on that, and it's going down, Okay. Even Orange Malquette is, he is cooperating more now. Okay? And I'm going to tell y'all this. They're starting to seal information in Dolph's case now. They're starting to seal it. Okay? So, um, get ready, y'all. Get ready. It's about to go down, y'all. Puffy is singing, singing, singing. I told y'all he was singing. And him and Jay-Z is best friends. Well, he th <laughs> Jay-Z thought he was his best friend. Um, best friends do this all the time, y'all. If they're not really friends like people think they are, okay? They know all of each other's dirt. And when it comes down to one going under, he going to take that other one with him the majority of the time, y'all. Especially when it comes down to stuff like this. You're talking about people being taken out, Okay? bodies dropping and they want it they want it all they want all of this information this is why now stuff you know that's associated with Dolph case is starting to be sealed this is why okay y'all um Dolph ain't the only one that's connected to these demons okay his passing it's a lot of bodies y'all so many coming out okay that the guy that was, the, they called him the godfather of hip hop or whatever he was of music. He went to a brunch, him and his wife, old guy. Okay. He'd been in the, uh, uh, in the, you know, industry for a very long time. Old rich guy. Okay. He said he was, you know, they were trying to get this guy to step down so somebody could take his position. At the brunch. Word on the street, y'all. And the person that was next up to take that position was Jay-Z, y'all. 
And you know what that man said at that brunch? He said, no, nah, I ain't about to give up my position no time soon. And he left that brunch, y'all. And armed guys came into his house on him and his wife and took her out, y'all. They took her out and left him looking stupid, okay? Because he was blowing bubbles and all kind of stuff after his wife was taken out in front of him. Okay, y'all. And he stepped down. Word on the street is, um, allegedly, 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 um, the Thompsons to Jay-Z and um, allegedly, P. Diddy and them made him eat his words, y'all. <laughs> yes, y'all. This is what they're good at, y'all. And now it's coming back to nip them in the tail, y'all. So much stuff is opening and reopening and cases are starting to be sealed now. Things are starting to get sealed in Dolph's case. And people that gave a little information but wouldn't give the feds more information, they are now giving them more information. They have to explain where this idea came from for you to wear the Bass Pro Shop hat. Is there a connection between Bass Pro Shop Hat and Jay-Z? And it is. It is, y'all. When criminals is out here, and y'all know this generation, is they hooked on crime. They're hooked on crime. This is why rap is so popular. All it is, this, you know, back and forth beefing with each other. This is why it's so popular in the industry. So y'all don't think that a person that's out here doing actual crimes... They rap about the crimes and they rap and they rap songs. So y'all don't think that a person that's on the news that's out here taking down bosses, y'all. Y'all don't think that their gear that they are wearing is going to the sales is gonna go through the roof. This is bigger than what we thought it was. It's major, y'all. Just like Mo 3 passing, it's major too. It's a lot of people tied to that passing, y'all. A lot of people got paid, and everybody in that inner circle, they all moved into bigger houses, y'all, after Mo3 was taken out on an expressway. Everybody moved. It's on record, y'all. That don't happen just out of the blue. Everybody in the inner circle moved. Everybody. The people that was attached to the movie, all of that. They came up off of Mo3's passing, just like they came up off of Dolph's. Now they're buying, you know, sports teams and hanging out at the White House. That don't just come without a price, y'all. But everything is falling apart right now because <laughs> they had Puffy on their side. And they got, the authorities got Puffy where they want him, y'all. They not looking for Puffy. If they want to arrest Puffy, they can arrest Puffy at any time. Puffy is negotiating, y'all. The bigger fishes, y'all. 2024 is the year of the bigger fishes, <laughs> y'all. It's going down right now. And people ain't realizing it, y'all. People still trying to steer away from the fact that um, this clothing line means so much more than y'all than y'all y'all can imagine. Y'all can imagine. This clothing line is tied to people's passing, y'all. Why did Orange Mal quit just go to court and now he's given more privileges? Privileges, y'all. He's given more privileges, y'all. he been asking for privileges for a long time, but now he has to play ball. Too much stuff is coming out, y'all. And y'all think he didn't know about the Bass Pro Shop connection? He did. They all know. Every last one of them. The industry knows the industry dirt when they're all kicking it together. He just did an interview talking about T.I. I've been telling y'all T.I. was in this inner circle too. He was at that meeting right before Mo3 was taken out. He was at that meeting too with Mob Ties now. Okay, y'all. And then this guy jump on and do his first interview and he's talking about T.I. Y'all. All of this connected and all of this call, he they call themselves going to try to throw authorities off and this and that and that and this. But now that this connection with the Bass Pro Shop stuff is popping out and Jay-Z pockets gets fatter, the more people wear this Pro Shop stuff. 
Okay, y'all? And he was beefing? He was trying to make Dolph sign with him? That's major, y'all. That's major. And the person that allegedly is on the film that was one of the hitters, allegedly, he has on your gear. He's throwing shout outs to you in his video while he's on the run, your company. He's throwing shout outs, y'all. People are starting to talk now. They have no choice, y'all. They have no choice. Two hours ago, alleged mastermind of Young Dolph's passing has bond terms changed, y'all. Do y'all understand this? The man that was accused of plotting the demise of Memphis rapper Young Dolph had the terms of his bond changed today, y'all. But Judge Jennifer Mitchell did not disclose what those changes were, y'all. The judge told her Nandez Gavan, Govan, that she was putting the amended terms under seal, y'all. She also told Gavin his attorney would explain the changes to him. He's working with them now. He's telling on my personal opinion to Jay-Z too and his connection and Yo Gotti's connection to Bass Pro Shop, y'all. This is bigger than what y'all think. I keep telling y'all. I keep telling y'all. They're putting stuff under seal. What y'all think else ain't going to be put under seal right now? They can't let out a lot of stuff. This is why all of the bloggers is confused right now as to what is going on with P. Diddy. Why is his houses getting raided? Why is the person that was selling him his, you know, supplying him his street pharmacy stuff getting arrested? His houses getting raided. But he's not getting arrested. There's pictures out going all around social media of P. Diddy talking to authorities. But he didn't get arrested. He'd been talking to authorities, y'all. He knew it was going to go down. He knew it was going to go down. They got a last footage of um, P. Diddy, you know, stuff the day before, prior. And he's at some type of party. And the only person that I noticed that was at that party, too, was that I know who it was, was uh, Flavor Flay. He was at the party, too. He walked past while they had the camera on P. Diddy. But look at this little circle, y'all. Just pay attention to this little circle. Don't y'all find it ironic that, you know, the last picture with Puffy doing street pharmacy stuff right on the film. If y'all go to it, I, I, I'm going to take some snapshots and show it to y'all. He's doing street pharmacy stuff. Doing lines, y'all. P. Diddy. In the footage. I put it in the next video. I ain't put all the pictures together yet. He's worried out his mind. His knee is shaking. I know some of y'all probably already seen it. Seen it. His knee is shaking and trembling and all of that stuff. Okay, y'all? Puffy knew what was coming. His knee is trembling because he is backdooring. He's snaking other snakes that he's associated with, y'all. That's why his knee is trembling like that in that video footage. He's pacing. They got another video of him pacing around and stuff. Well, you know, they get getting ready to do what they do to his houses. And find his underground tunnels and all of this other stuff. Okay, y'all. He's pacing. He ain't pacing about what they gonna find. He already know what he sent them in there to get. In the negotiations. My personal opinion. He already knew. He's pacing because he know the same thing Kanye know. Jay-Z got hit us. And if he know you about to snake him and bring down his empire, hmm, you think he not about to come for you? This is why they don't want to tell well he is. Is he in protective custody? Ask yourself that question, y'all. Is P. Diddy in protective custody while he is bringing down Jay-Z? You're talking about bodies. On top of bodies, on top of bodies. I did a count. I was like, how many bodies can y'all attack, you know, Puffy to? People said in between 12 to 30 bodies. It's connected to, you know, um, Jay-Z allegedly. I don't know, but this is what people said. When I asked, how many bodies do y'all, have y'all heard? Because everybody that heard all the rumors. 
and now Dolph, and then you are on top of, that's some bold stuff to take somebody out and advertise your clothing line at the same time. They did the same thing with Mo3. Go back to my old videos. Pull up Mo3 videos. They advertise clothing lines why the same way, y'all. The same way. They thought they got away with taking Mo3 out. That's still stalled. And word on the street, they are investigating some people that was very close to the situation, y'all. Some of the people that was putting up posts talking about, um, y'all want to make 10 bands? They're on... <laughs> They're being investigated now, y'all. It's a lot going on in both of these cases. They waking up to the fact that these are the same people that set up Mo3. It's the same people that set up Dolph, y'all. And they use the same tactic, y'all. And I guess Jay-Z thought that this wasn't going to come back to them to nip them in their tail. But now, he jumped in the, he jumped in the water when he put straight drop them and, um... Bass Pro Shop clothing. When they put it in the videos, that was the icing on the cake, y'all. You were promoting your clothing line and everything else. Who, what happened when, um, didn't, didn't Trap Boy and them put the stuff in the video, clues? All kind of stuff about Mo3? Same thing. They were promoting, y'all. And they promoted with Dolph, too. This is huge, y'all. People want to ignore it all they want to. But it's huge. They are sealing. Terms under seal. They starting to seal stuff now, y'all. This is what they're doing. And word on the street, this one is cooperating too. Because this is major. You the one that were wearing the clothes. So now they want to know from him. And they already know now. Who told you to wear it? Who specifically told you to wear Brass Pro Shop hats on the scene of the crime. Who specifically told you and helped you and edited it and all of this other stuff? Because he was on the run. Now, how much editing can you do on the run in the car? Ask yourself this question, y'all. He had Bass Pro Shop hat stuff popping up on the video before the video came on good. And he started rapping. Bass Pro Shop was promoted first, y'all. As y'all get in the picture, that's a major part of this whole situation, y'all. And don't be surprised that a lot of most stuff start being sealed in Dolph's case, y'all. It's about to go down, y'all. I told y'all they're going to tap Memphis if they don't get justice for Dolph. And they're moving in the right direction now because they got Puffy on their side. And, and Puffy knows so much stuff, y'all. He knows so much stuff. Puffy know, he knew about Prince. He knew about Michael Jackson. Why y'all think that he came out one year with the Prince? He was taunting Prince because his friends, the ones, him and his friends, allegedly the ones that took out Prince. This is why he was taunting Prince, y'all. Dressing up, you know, like Prince and, and taunting him. This is what Puffy was doing, y'all. When I tell you it's about to go
young Dolph situation. Let me know what y'all think about stuff starting to be sealed in Dolph's case. Um, let me know what y'all think because I, I truly believe in my heart of hearts this is what's going down because this is what I was hearing on the streets. Okay, y'all? This is what I was hearing. And I'm going to tell y'all, you don't don't be sleep on the streets because some people know the whole nine yards of what's going on out here. They know. Don't be sleep on the streets. I'm telling y'all. I know some people be like, oh, I'm putting out this and this and that and that. It ain't here, so it ain't this and that. A lot of people that will not talk to the police, they're scared to talk to authorities. They know about crimes and stuff like that. They just keep it to themselves. Just because they choose to, you know, who they want to let that information out to, it ain't my fault. It ain't my fault. And putting up proof is out in a lot of people. So this is why I don't. I don't. So I'm just telling y'all, um, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Anyway, y'all, please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.